Welcome everyone. So in any drawing, the usual practice is to first set the units. So I am doing the same here. I'm going to select architectural and for position, I'm going to choose one over four. And okay. Now let's just leave everything else the same. It is a 120 square yard house. So I'm going to first make the footprint, which would not be of 120 square yards, but it would be more. So the rectangle would be of the length 32.86 feet in X dimension and 46.56 feet in the Y dimension. So I am entering the coordinates likewise, and you can also see these coordinates on the screen. Keep in mind that this is the footprint and not the 120 square yard house. And in this, we are going to make a boundary of 120 square yards. So for 120 square yards, I would need 32.86 feet in X and 32.86 feet in Y dimensions. But keep in mind that we are giving the points in the negative Y dimensions. So I will have to specify negative in the Y coordinate. Now I'm going to give the offset of the inner boundary and outer boundary both. Now let's start with our house interior. First of all, I'm making a rectangle of 5 feet 3 inches in X and negative 5 feet in Y direction or dimension. Negative because we are drawing in negative Y direction. Now let's just make another rectangle covering the whole area beside the or the rectangle I just made. I'm not going giving any directions or dimensions here. I have just taken two opposite points through object snap and now just let's just make the offset of these two rooms. At 10 inches, the true distance will be 10 inches. Let's make another rectangle of 11 feet in X and negative 12 feet 3 inches in Y dimension. And in the opposite corner, make a rectangle of negative 11 feet 5 inches and negative 12 feet 3 inches in Y dimension. Both of these dimensions are negative because we are working against the axes. After this, we are just going to add the offsets of whatever we have added to this house, keeping the same true distance. And now let's, let's just connect these two rectangles with another rectangle and we are going to give it the dimensions of 7 feet 1.25 inches and negative 8 feet 1.5 inches in X and Y dimensions respectively. And like always, we are going to give a this rectangle an offset of 10 inches through distance. So let's just set the offset of 10 inches through through distance. Let's be done with the rest, last rectangle, starting from this corner point. And I, after this, I'm giving it the dimensions of negative 8 feet in X and negative 12 feet 3.25 inches in Y dimension negative because we are working against the axes. Now type the trim command, select all the uh, drawing and after right clicking, left click on the unwanted lines and get them erased. So let's just trim out all the unwanted walls or the lines that are showing in the contour of this house. Let's just get rid of all of these. Now we are almost done with trimming. In this part, we have uh, written the rectangle coordinates. In the next one, I will uh, be writing only the areas for the rectangles. Thanks for watching. That is it from this part. See you in the next one.